In Donetsk tonight, there were two demonstrations on one square. These protesters were calling for a united Ukraine and denouncing Russia's occupation of the Crimea. And across Lenin Square, supporters of Russia and President Putin. The police line wasn't strong enough to keep the two sides apart. This was the result. A battle in the center of Donetsk. It's the worst violence Ukraine has seen since Viktor Yanukovych was removed from power. In recent days, tension has been rising in eastern Ukraine. Some officials here have accused Russia of stoking the unrest and of sending extremists across the border to provoke trouble. Moscow denies that. The Russians accuse the Ukrainians of attacking the rights of Russian speakers here. Earlier, military observers from Europe and the United States had spent the day traveling around the Donetsk region to assess the situation on the ground. They'd been invited here by the Ukrainian army. They were taken to see the border. This, one of the main crossing points into Russia. It's working normally, but the Ukrainians are watching very closely who's coming in. We've detected extremists trying to come across, the commander says, people who want to take part in radical actions. Scenes like this will raise fears that extremists are trying to provoke violence in eastern Ukraine and spark chaos across the country. Steve Rosenberg, BBC News, Donetsk.